okay guys so today i'm gonna show you a brand new load cell so this is a new one we are we are gonna be changing for our machine so this is a load cell which is a brand new its brand is zemic so it's a load carrying capacity is a 15 kg so it has its own specification at the bottom i mean at the body of the uh, the package so let's open and how, what it looks like so let us see it together all right so this is uh, the, the terminal connector cable which is uh, a signal cable so it's a uh, five different cables with uh, the green black white red and uh, a bell color so this is uh, the uh, certification the calibration uh, paper which is so called it uh, uh, the full information of the the lower cell is already displayed in here already written in here so we have to take uh, the basic uh, calibration test based upon this manual so it's a uh, model hm 11 c3 15 kg 3b wc so serial number the material is uh, uh, so called it steel alloy it was a capacity of 15 kg excitation and insulation uh, rates or insulation resistance is uh, it's, it's less than uh, 5000 or it is so called it 15 voltage dc so these are the very important parameters which are already displayed already written on the description so it have a calibration data so the calibration data is uh, the very important one and the other thing is the electrical uh, connection as i said earlier so the electrical connection for the uh, compression uh, positive we have a green we have the black white we have red and we have a rare so this rare is the shield one and uh, the red one is just for the negative signal and the white one is for the positive signal the black one is for the negative excitation and the green one is a positive excitation so this is the connection so at the body of the at the lower cell uh, let us check it so you can see from here uh, you have to align you have to put uh, the load cell uh, based on the direction which is already written at, at the body of the load cell and the manual so this is a zemic one and the basic uh, uh, specification is already written over it so this how uh, the load cell uh, looks like so later on uh, i will show you the basic configuration and the connection really on the machine but basically the, the the electrical connection the electrical connection is the very important thing after uh, putting the machine or this lower cell over the machine so this is uh, so now this is the alignment direction uh, you can see the, the the down arrow we have we have to put this lower cell according to the direction of this arrow so we don't uh, interchange the direction one is we change the direction and we put over the machine maybe uh, the, the calibration error happen so you have to align you have to put the lower cell according to the direction it's the perfect direction of the lower cell alignment and this uh, model description is directly visible for anybody in this manner if you're spokal you, sh you shift the direction we don't uh, have a chance to read to read even uh, uh, the description in a detailed way mm -hmm. so this one is uh, the, the position so this is a connection uh, i will show you the detail later on but um, this is uh, the first location we put our load cell so we have uh, the old load cell. So we have four different groups of the same type of load cell. 
we have uh, one, two, three, uh, and four. So we have uh, the front direction and the rear direction. So the front and the rear direction, uh, the, the terminal connection is uh, in the reciprocal manner. So you can see from here. So the electrical connection is, uh, is looks like this. So we have five different uh, cables, the yellow, the, the black, the white, the red, and the, the bare one. So as I said before, we have the positive terminal, we have the negative terminal, and we have the shield terminal. So that is it.